Who can tell me a little bit about your, your shade shelter here? Uh, it's it's, it's going to like block the sun from going up and then we're doing sides. And How's it going to yeah, block and, that sun? And we need it, so we're going to make walls all over the place. Yeah, we're going to make, make walls. walls and no we're, even walls. Yeah, wherever the spaces are. Wherever and no windows. Are. No windows. Why no windows? Because it'll make the sun go in and it might melt the popsicle. Oh. Yeah. I see you guys changed your design. You want to tell me about your changes? Yes, I did it. We need a teepee. Yeah, how are you going to use that teepee? We're going to put, like, paper over it to keep the popsicle over the shade with those papers. Mmm, I see. You're gonna put the paper over the popsicle teepees. Which side of that paper are you gonna use? Which one's gonna be facing out? The, the white. light. How come? Cause, cause the light paper makes the sun go away and the dark paper makes it push in. Ma oh, so the white paper makes the sun go away? Like, go away in the sky? It just disappears? No, it doesn't like disappear, it just doesn't make it go here. Okay, it just doesn't make it go to the popsicle? Alright. What do you mean when you say the word reflect? Like, it's when it gets the sun away from it. When it gets the sun away from it, okay. Inside, students analyze two bits of data. The liquid freeze pop that had been poured into the graduated cylinder outside, and the leftover freeze pop that had since melted still in the wrapper. Class, raise your hand if you can make an observation about these popsicles. What do you guys think? What do you observe, Georgia? Um, I observe that um, there is more um, juice in the green than the yellow. Good. So, so what does that mean? definitely melted more. more or what's another word we could say it melted less quicker right it melted quicker than the other possible and mm. more of it melted very good what else do you observe mm. hey? um, I feel like it looks like um, it all melted but I guess like I kind of but I I like have a little ice in it Okay, yeah, have they all kind of melted now? There's a little bit of ice left in them, but why Why are they all melted now? Oh, because when we walked, um, like, there was sun and there was no shade, so it kind of melted. Yeah, it kind of melted, but we dumped what melted um, after we took them out of the shade structure into our graduated cylinders, right? I got 12. Did we get this? Mm. No. We're not going to keep those, though. I'll go we back. got 12. So this right here shows us that, did our shade structures do the trick? Yeah. Did they work? Yeah. Yes. Yes. Did all of our shade structures protect our popsicles from melting as quick as the one out in the sun? Yeah. Yes. Did, did any 
Did any group keep their popsicle completely frozen the whole time? No. Yes. What? Yes. Yes? No. Right. Who can explain no. their thing? Maybe why or why not? What What did you notice? Did What did you think, friend? Did any of them stay totally frozen the whole time? Mm -hmm. So if it was completely frozen, how much would dump out when we poured none. it into a graduate cylinder? Like none. Like none, right? If it was completely frozen, nothing would drip out. Okay. Let's all make a circle around our our graduated cylinders here. But take a few sits, uh, take a, two, a few scrunches back, all right? Let's put the sunny one in the middle so we can compare it to all the others. Right. As the most. It has the most what? Um, juice. Juice that was frozen or melted? Melted. Melted. Mm -hmm. Which one has the least? Let's check these numbers here. Whose is this group? Yeah, what did the reds group, what did you get for a count? What did you get for how many milliliters? Twelve. Twelve milliliters. Okay, how about the green group? What did the green group Eleven. get? Eleven. Eleven milliliters. What about the blue group? What did the blue group get? 12. 12. 12 milliliters. And the last group, the purple 12. group. What did the purple group 12. get? 12. 12. And the last 12 group. milliliters also. Okay. And what about Mr. Muscleman's Sunny 35. Popsicle? Let's check that one. 36. 30. 36. 6. 35. It's right on that line in between the 30 and the 40. We so did, was there the one that was the best? Mm -hmm. Was there a best yes. shade shelter? Yeah. Yes. Which one was it? The green. Mr. Muscle. The green one which melted how much? 10 milliliters. 10 or 11, 11 milliliters. Yeah. What does that smell like? Right. Right, we're going to go back to our tables and we're going to figure out with some math just how much less your popsicle melted compared to Mr. Musselman's, okay? Let's go do that. Let's try that math with these sheets that Mrs. Duncan has right here. After analyzing the appearance of their freeze pops and quantifying how much had melted, students were able to use these pieces of evidence to support their claim that their shade shelter was able to protect their popsicle.